What's up, guys? It is your boy, Lavon Kaysen, back at it again with another reaction video. Today, I'm going to be reacting to Big Brother's video, which is called Beefing Up Security, featuring McJuggernuggets and Psycho Dad. So, yeah, let's begin. Tell me. Sorry guys, I just had to practice on my close-ups and the panning, you know, because at this point, I feel like I need to try out for the camera competition. No talent out there, I swear to God. You are so, ouch. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you, stop it. Oh, you just use this. I swear to God, every time I put the camera on you, you lose your mind. You lose your mind, Pubber. Stop it, stop it. Jesse. Yeah. What's Jesse doing now? We have a little What's chat. he doing now? He's trying to edit right now. Well, I'm trying to live in this house without having my peace disrupted. Oh, I forgot there were doors here. Whoa. What are you gonna slide this up? Yeah, you're supposed to be on that side of it. Oh, true. Did you ever find the post? Oh, you found the post in there that I put on the sliding doors. I'm getting a phone call, dude. Do you mind? Actually, I do. So what's the deal with this bag of money thing? Oh crap. I'm really, we're really not oh, talking crap. about that. I'll tell you that right now. Wow. About no bag of money. Wow, that was pretty good, yeah? Wow. Well, I'm curious because as a resident of this house, I'm a little concerned of the source of the bag of money. Great, I just missed this call. What are you doing? Oh, There's a door there. I know, it's the damnedest thing, huh? I want to talk about the money. Well, I want to. Where'd you get it? I, I got it from the realtor's office. I already said that. Okay. And you have no idea where it came from. It came from behind a bookcase. I don't know. There was not like a, a note on it that said this is from the bank. Then why does Karen, why is she concerned about her well-being? I don't know. Because I don't know. You don't what know do you mean you don't know, Jesse? I, I don't what know. do you mean you don't know? What do you mean? Money. Well, yeah, clearly. He doesn't throw and a tree, Jeffrey. It's, some, it's somebody. Well it's, aware you know. of that. But if she's concerned for her well-being, and she's not the one that took the money, you did. That means you should it. be concerned for your well-being. And no, me, I live here too, so I feel like I should be a little concerned as just a resident. The gone, Jeffrey, so like, I didn't take it. Somebody else took it, so it's out of my hands. It's not. I didn't steal it. Somebody else did. From me, so I am not gonna be in trouble for this. Well, what if Karen says that you stole it? Uh, somebody could literally search the whole house. I don't have the money anymore. I mean, if you were the last one that had it. What do you think? I pretended that somebody took the money so I could throw everyone off the scent, and I actually do have the money. No, I don't have the freaking money. Wow, that's pretty elaborate, Jeff. I didn't think you would actually reveal your whole plan right then and there, exactly. huh? Exactly. Therefore, it's not actually a thing. I don't so know. So if you think it. that, I don't then surely. Talk about it. I don't know. I don't know where it is. It happened at the party. I was like ten shots deep. Mm hmm Regina squad had hit up there. Karen was already asking me about it. There was some dude in a leather jacket who was mad. It is amazing of what money can do to people. It is just amazing. Now. That money bag had about, you know, six figures worth of cash in there. And seeing that amount of money, you know, will make people think things way differently. Sketchy. There was a dude in a leather jacket that was mad sketchy? Yeah, he kept saying saloon or whatever. Like, I guess he works at a salon. Maybe that might be the guy that took Jesse's money. Wait, salud? I don't know. I don't remember. I was drunk. I remember editing the video, and I was like, I don't know who this guy was. I, didn't, I don't even remember if I got a name. Isn't that what, like, Italians say before they drink something? That would make sense. Like, cheers or drinking. something? We drank together, I think. I think that was him. I don't know. I don't know. This is why you never knew about the money to begin with, because people get all freaking weird. About oh, I'm money. sorry if I'm getting weird. I'm just concerned that maybe it becomes a little bit of a security issue around here. 
if somebody's after a bag of money and thinks that you have it. Have good point. Setup, good point. I you have, have a camera plasma setup? sword in that. Yeah, you have a camera set up by my truck in the truck port. What good does that do? In case somebody wants to steal some crap from there. It's leaves and a ramp. It could be a back access point. I don't freaking know. I just put, I had three, so I put one there. Mm. I'm glad that you're taking this so seriously. <laughs> Where's the boonies, mm. Right. But it's some <laughs> sketchy dude in a leather jacket who you have no idea who is. There's no reason for It's any, in our house. There's no more reason for any sketch to happen here because I don't have anything to sketch about. I have no money. We have a mortgage. That and maybe have only freaking few thousand dollars in the house. There's no value here. But if you were the last person with that bag of money, it becomes last, your problem I'm to not find the last it. Last person, somebody else has it. Well, and they were at the party. So, if you want to do a whole wild goose hunt and ask every single mother at that was at the party, be my guest. Half those people are more like your friends than mine. Well, I'm not gonna go talk to them. All right, then I don't know what you keep hearing about. Oh my god. Ooh. Yeah, that's that's what I'm really after. So let's make sure that I get all that money. Yep, that's what I then I can pay off this house. Yep, and... exactly. Yep. Is this front door even locked? I don't know. Is this is this unlocked? I don't check. I, we have a driveway unlocked. Oh wow! Look at this. Don't worry. Set up a deadbolt for you. Okay. Do I have to keep my side of the house locked? Oh my god. Oh no. Don't you dare do it. Stop. Stop. Jesus. You are crazy. Oh. Yeah, he's not very ferocious, though. Not much of a guard dog. Oh, I don't even have a deadbolt. Uh, and then we mean to stop it. Mad Dad's house. Left a few things there. We need to do like a oh, did you, did you? All right, stop we're leaving. We're leaving. Okay. Come on. Jeez, you're out of your mind. Out of your mind. Where the heck did she go? Oh, there you are. Here. Get in my way. No, you can't take that. You can't take that. Thank you. Jesus. Oh my god, I got a cup holder. Oh my god, I don't lick it. Ah! That's a good girl. She's like the perfect passenger. Maybe that's what we need. A big gate. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Cool beans, right? Cool beans. Oh, come on. Oh. There you go. Hmm. Get back to the old armory. <laughs> it's a very sad armory. Oh my god. It was nice at one point. Who am I kidding? No, it wasn't. All right, perfect. Got uh, yeah, my quiver, and my actual recurve bow. That's a must. Oh Jesus, that was loud. Okay, crossbow, you're broken. What the heck is this? Oh, that's right. They're batarang throwing stars. Batarang. Like a dual blade knife. Interesting. Got some throwing knives. I should probably grab the paintball guns, like shoot them in the face, whoever's coming. You know what I mean? A little, 
little removal of the eyeball action. <gasps> Wait a minute, these are my lights. Oh, I could use that for filming stuff. There's my second spare. Oh. Where is it? Where is it? I know, oh, there's the barrel for it. There's the nitro tank, where's my dye rice? <sighs> Gotta be, and there she is. There she is. Now oh, this. Oh, I lost my barrel over here. Gotta make sure I bring that. Do I need the drone? Do some aerials just in case. Oh crab! I'm uh grabbing some oh, of my crab. things. Got my lights, my paintball gun. Got some throwing stars. Got my recurve bow. Why are you yeah. taking that stuff? You got stuff upstairs. You got the bookcase. You got all the crap in the closet. Why don't you take that? Well, you know, the, we're, we're having a bit of um, a trespassing issue. Oh. So I just want to make sure that I have all the necessary materials. To... So you got a security issue? Yeah. Yeah, basically. How bad? Uh, it, not sure, but it seems like it could be pretty bad. Like I know Jesse's got some like cameras on the corners of the property, but like I feel like we need a little bit more. We really need to beef it up a bit. So. And you know I got that guy, right? Wait, wh what? The guy that put all the cameras here. The guy that did all the trail cameras. The gate. You want him? I mean. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it, what? What, what can he help me with? Out there. It's what I deal with through work and everything. So. Like a consultant, I guess. Or, yeah. Yeah. Uh, if you want to give him my number, it's going to be costly. How? It's like a ghost. I'm telling you, you can't, you don't never know he's there. All his equipment he puts out, you don't see it. Do you know how costly it is, or? Well, look, I'll, I'll give you, you know, I'll give you his information. I'll give him your cell phone number. You guys contact each other, and that'll be that'll be all I have to do with it. All right. All right. Yeah, that well, sounds good to me. Okay, like I'll be honest, like I. I need to apply what are you for. What do with that, though? Well, I, don't know. I need to. He's no... professional. You don't need to have to worry about that crap. Well, just in case. Well, yeah, of course. You know, at the last resort. I mean, I could. But if it's... you got somebody that's going to take care of it for you, it's less of a headache for you and less of a worry, right? And less yeah. of a worry mm. for your parents. Yeah, that's mm. true. Good All point. Right. Someone take this. <laughs> yeah, take it with you. Yeah. But either way, I'll get the uh, information to him, and then he'll contact you. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Sounds good to me. Thank you. Uh -huh. And get the uh, bookshelf out upstairs, too. What do I need a bookshelf right now for, though? There's crap in there. You got your stuff going there. I came to clean it. Take it with you. And the crap out of the garage, too. I don't have any. Uh, here, just a couple Thank things. <laughs> I don't know who he's talking about, but that peace of mind might be what I need. What we both need. But me and Kate, not, not me and Jess. Ooh. Ooh. Still can't make a bullseye. <laughs> Alright, so that, that was it. That was the whole video. So. The McJuggernuggets brothers are going to ha be having more security. Which will be interesting. Which means it'll make it harder for Psycho Dad. To come into their house. Than it already is. But that's all I have to say. With the video itself. What did you guys think of the video? What do you guys think of the quality of this video? Are you guys liking the quality of this video? Let me know in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hit that notification bell to be notified. For future Levon Kaysen videos. And yeah. Peace. Share this video on Facebook and Twitter.